Hello everyone, it's Felipe here. Welcome back. So today's video is a little bit different. So it's not any review video or going through my unopened backlog collections. As you can see, the two minifigures here, they all share a uh, similar theme. On the left, you've got the uh, chef minifigure, and on the right um, is uh, Marshmallow Man. So technically, he's not a um, you know a food piece, but today's video is all about um, you know food in a Lego form. So throughout the years, LEGO has uh, released uh, different food in different forms and uh, here's um, my collections and you can see you know, I have lots of food collections because I really like to uh, collect things um, especially like uh, LEGO pieces uh, especially in recent years, LEGO has uh, upped the game with uh, different uh, printed tiles there are lots of stuff here. So in the early days, you know, Lego only started with like bottles and and cups. Doesn't really represent a uh, food. And then they start introducing like you know printed piece of pieces later on, and also uh, the croissant and the uh, well, you can call it turkey, but it often used as chicken. And you know the drumstick piece can be uh, taken out by itself, but you know it's hard to take it. But one hand, something like this. In recent years, with the collectible minifigure series and also the uh, Chinese New Year theme, uh, which really upped the game to another level, they start introduce a lots of new printed pieces like uh, you know the the updated pizza and and also you know, lots of uh, the Chinese food over here, and sometimes also like you know specialized uh, food pieces like this. And today I'm gonna to go through uh, my my collection of uh, food related Lego pieces. We're gonna start off with uh, some of the uh, more traditional, uh, older style representation of food. Obviously, the, uh, the turkey that I mentioned before, the croissant. We've got some uh, cherries. It comes in like you know various different colors, and also uh, the apple and the uh, long bread. Like this is just uh, one color. It also comes with uh, I think in in two different colors. And then take away those. Oh, okay. And this one, you know, these two pieces kind of representing uh, ice cream, but you know, it you see in the different variation like like popcorns and and some other things. So this is also quite useful. And then we've got some uh, drink bottles here. Those are some of the earliest stuff that release. You know, you can represent a uh, empty bottle. You can also represent a uh, fully unopened wine. Uh, obviously for you know, obvious reason that Lego not going to uh, specifically or explicitly call out to the alcohol. And with some like cups and mugs over here, uh, it's been you know out there for long, long time. But then you know, recently you start to have like different variations, like uh, the one with this unique drink, and also the the cup is a bit newer, uh, only introduced in recent years, which is a uh, really useful pieces that you get um, you know from many other sets and here we have the bowl um, we introduced from the uh, Chinese New Year theme and also from the uh, Ninjago movie mini figure so what's good here is that uh, you can actually put uh, some flat towel inside uh, the bowl so here you've got the printed rice pieces uh, from the Chinese New Year set, so you get a bowl of rice here. And throughout the years, there are also uh, various drinks. So you can see uh, from uh, the Simpson uh, theme, you've got the, the bus cola and also the, uh, the squishy drink. And from the collectible minifigure, you've got this um, you know bubble tea from the Lin Jago uh, movie uh, minifigures, uh, and also a uh, purely water bottle. There are also this uh, takeaway coffee cup. Uh, so the one with the print is uh, exclusive to the uh, Lego movie collectible minifigure series and from other Lego themes uh, you get this generic unprinted uh, takeaway coffee cup. Before we take a look at the other printed uh, pieces, Lego also released this uh, Lego extra uh, pack of food. You can see you know bananas, eggs, you know, sauces, well so you can put condiments, watermelon pieces, cherry pieces, and apple and pretzel as well. So there are lots of you know unique uh, food pieces from Lego uh, lately. 
In fact, the lobster piece is also introduced as a food piece from the Lego Batman movie collectible minifigure series, but later evolved into uh, a uh, sea creature pieces. Yeah, underneath the lobster, you've got this uh, printed uh, salad. Uh, again, it's from the uh, uh, Lego uh, Batman movie collectible minifigure series. Also, uh, from the Big Bang Theory uh, Lego idea set, you also get this uh, Chinese takeaway box. Talking about dishes, you have this dish with the uh, printed chili on. Uh, it used uh, for uh, you know placing taco pieces, which they do uh, come in uh, a printed tile. This is the uh, taco print, and of course you can never miss the uh, Lego hot dog, uh, which is the hot dog bun piece uh, with the sausage piece inside, and you can see it here. You know, the sausage uh, comes in various colors. That's just two variations of it. It just comes in like, you know, green. And well, obviously, in those colors, you're not supposed to be <laughs> use it as a sausage. But um, in terms of food usage, you got this red, um, you know, the, the darker uh, red color. And recently, they also uh, come in brown. You also get this uh, Lego hamburger here, which is from uh, the Lego Scooby Doo theme, or at least I got it from that theme that uh, a set that I bought. Uh, and also the specialized bread from the uh, Harry Potter uh, minifigure series. And then here we have the uh, Lego pizza and also uh, the, the popcorn. Usually they put the uh, popcorn piece on top of it, but you can just have the popcorn boxes. Uh, pizza have got like various. Uh, uh, print so this is from the collectible minifigure series. This is more of the updated preset pin, and this is the 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 OG preset print. Uh, the preset print also comes in this uh, piece as well, and of course, if you get four, you can uh, create the whole piece from four of this. Talks about takeaway. Uh, you also get this takeaway box, uh, and also this uh, fry noodle piece uh, from the uh, Monkey Kids series. You also get this spaghetti bolognese uh, piece from uh, the uh, Lego Friends series. And some Lego cereals. Uh, this is from uh, the Ninjago uh, movie uh, minifigure series. Uh, some chopstick and a spoon uh, from a printed tile from the Chinese New Year set. Uh, and, and this year they also introduced a new uh, chopstick piece which I haven't got my hands onto yet. And often you get raw food material, which of course you can uh, just eat it raw if you want. But you know, this is a nice, uh, oh, just fix the camera. Here's a nice pumpkin piece, and uh, just from the Scooby Doo series, the traditional um, carrot. Um, again, this is a use of different color to create uh, the grape, and this is introduced from the French theme as well. Uh, this is the uh, chop. The meat chop, uh, well, you can call it like, you know, T-bone stick uh, from the collectible minifigure series and the peach from uh, Monkey Kid. So these are all really good and useful Lego pieces. Some uh, Lego eggs, uh, well, sunny side up eggs. Uh, this one is the more common one. This is um, quite rare. It's actually used as a weapon piece from uh, the Lego uh, Batman movie set, uh, which with the villain Eggman, uh, you, you get three of this from this set. It's really hard to uh, uh, get this one. And this year, from the city theme, they also introduce a different type of uh, egg piece as well. This is the uh, cupcake piece, uh, which is uh, quite common, uh, but lately uh, they kind of replaced by the poop piece using as a chocolate mousse or ice cream. It also comes with the white color. Uh, which is good, uh, especially that piece uh, will make a better look ice cream with the ice cream cone piece here. And who can forget the uh, pie piece? This is introduced from the Simpson theme and from the collectible mini uh, figure series. You get this new updated uh, pie with a strawberry print on top. A nice uh, print uh, to represent a uh, steam bun from uh, the Chinese New Year theme, and of course, you can use this as the head of some other creatures if you want. The Lego Harry Potter series also introduced us to the uh, beer glass uh, with two different colors um, and 
I personally love this one more because you can add a uh, white piece on top to actually create a uh, really filled up uh, beer glasses. Oh, I mentioned about about the egg piece when I was talking about the other sunny side of egg. So uh, this egg piece is quite common. You do get it from various sets. The module building also introduces uh, these two new uh, donut pieces. Of course, um, it uses as logo, but you can always use as a extra big donut. And Lego loves to create uh, small printed pieces uh, for food items like this um, you know, cookie here, some uh, candies, uh, the watermelon. Somehow I've got like uh, in two <laughs> different colors, one in pink and uh, one in bright red. I hope they also come with one uh, with yellow. Uh, there's some uh, you know chocolate here as well. Um, they, actually for, for Lego, I don't have it in this pack here, but I do have like the other pieces like you know, the more traditional cookies, uh, the donuts, and there's also a chocolate bar piece. And finally, we look at all the new printed food tiles introduced from one uh, single Chinese theme. Uh, so, and, and finally, we take a look at all the printed uh, Chinese cuisine, uh, all introduced from one single Chinese New Year set. Uh, so, yeah, all the printed uh, food here it's got you know some uh, fried prawns, uh, spring rolls, uh, some steamed buns. Uh, you know, for me, my favorite is this one definitely the the uh, dumplings. Uh, the, the girls are this is the, the fried dumplings. You've also got, also got some you know traditional chicken crab dishes, and and also this uh, you know vegetables here, but. For me, my favorite is definitely uh, the dumpling. So these are actually quite useful, uh, and I'm glad that you know Lego introduced so many of these uh, printed food tiles, which kind of opened the door for a lot more uh, variation, uh, you know, in in recent sets. And here is my collection of Lego food items. Of course, it's not you know every single uh, one of food related items released by Lego, but you know this is what I've got here right now. That's not a complete list, but I really like you know collecting um, new Lego uh, food pieces, whether it's printed or, or molded. And I look forward to uh, Lego to release more uh, new prints um, that will be exciting. Uh, molded if it's even better uh, in, in the near future. And to let me know what's your favorite food uh, piece uh, from Lego in the comment section below, and be sure to subscribe uh, and, and like this videos for more upcoming updates. And I'll see you next time.